I'm gonna call Peter Brown now and see if uh, he can give me a tow in if if that's what has to happen. <sighs> Possible sh end to a very exciting day. It's been a while since I've gotten out here. This is literally my first cage. I'm gonna have to go in. Alright, I'm gonna try to call Peter one more time. He has two phones, so I'm gonna keep trying both of them. I can literally see his boat. Hey Peter. Are you you're on your farm, right? I, uh, I might be stuck over here. Yeah, um, so there was a lot of steam coming out of the, uh, the engine room just now. I shut, ev I shut everything down, um, and two I called Tooth. So he told me not to start it, and he said if I could see you to call you and see if, if, uh, if I need it, I might need a tow. Alright, thanks Peter. Alright, bye. Bye. Ah, we got him on the phone. <laughs> Here comes Peter now. Alright, so here's what happened. Um, we pulled the boat because it started to take on a significant amount of water. Couldn't figure out where it was coming from after we got it out of the water. Uh, so we replaced all the through holes. Um, I filmed a lot of that with tooth and we decided to you know, replace things like the zincs, uh, paint the bottom, paint the whole boat. It needed, uh, it needed some maintenance anyway. It should be back out next week, uh, rocking and rolling. So, uh, here's what we did for all of the maintenance work and uh, the through holes and everything that we had to do while the boat was out of the water. Hope you enjoy it.
sharp. Oh, that's better. No? Ah, dude, you suck. <laughs> yeah, it broke my shit. Alright, this is Tooth. And he's putting in the through holes. He's the one we've been waiting on. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Ten fingers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like yesterday. Yeah. Push down as hard as you can. Yep. Okay. Oh shit. Huh? That almost went in my hand. Huh? That almost went in my hand. Oh, shit. I didn't think of that. Imagine I don't even know what I would do if I put if I put the screw through your hand. Probably would have just left. <laughs> 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 Good. Hopefully they don't leak. <laughs> anyway, if you need uh, if you need boat work, this guy loves to do boat work. Tooth. You can message me and I can give you his information. Unhooking this piece of, uh, of dock. I'm gonna try to keep the camera going. Is that GoPro recording? Yeah. Huh? All right, I got this line here. I'm gonna go really super slow. I'll just have you tied off short. Okay. Yeah, just pull yourself along. I'm gonna get off. I'll get my boat all in time and back around. Standing on a large piece of floating dock. And uh, we're gonna try to drag this thing behind Peter's boat. And he's gonna drag me, standing on this piece of dock, through the marina to the opposite side where we're gonna tie this piece of dock and the, uh, the other end. Wish us luck. Sunrise brings morning light Bloodshot eyes, smokes will escape I've been drinking all night And I've been running from the devil to Give you an idea of where we just went through That's what we just went through See how we do this. Um, we're gonna drop this trough into the center of this floating dock that we just moved across the marina.
So we're starting on micro mesh. Yes. And it's it's hard because I mean the oysters grow, but you don't get a lot of flow because it's like yeah. That's the micro mesh. Yeah. Be several weeks with this. Wow. And then we go up to what after that? Two. Two. Two minutes. <laughs> Which is Wild. nothing. No, I, this is and gonna then, be the first for me to see the. Uh, yeah, and then the it's seed. good for you to learn this. Yeah, yeah. Then we'll get to four mil, and then eventually six, and that's what we grew out on last year was most. Yeah, of six. that's when I jumped in. And they were cranking. Yep. Yeah, when you're getting stuff that looks like sand. <laughs> that's about what the consistency is gonna be like. Sand? Yeah, like um, clay sand. Wow. The little grains of sand, and they're oysters. That's wild. Yeah, the volume. I mean. Uh, a million might look like um, two liters. Like that a Coke is bottle. wild. And I figure it's going to fill this thing several times. That's a really nice flow, huh? Yeah, well, everything's empty. Guess who's here? That is one million oyster seeds. I'm really excited right now. Um, I'm headed to the marina to go acclimate them and then put them in the upweller that you saw Peter Brown and I uh, put together. I've never actually done this before, um, so it's, it's pretty exciting for me to do. Um, Peter was kind of teaching me some stuff about it yesterday. Uh, we went over some acclimation. And uh, it's pretty wild. There's a million little oysters in that box right there. Yeah, we'll see you down at the dock. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm definitely pumped for this one. See you down there. So they look like this is one million. All right, let's go after me. 